Okay, so the first question says to determine the mean, median, mode, and range for the following data set, 3, 7, 4, 2, and 3. And so this is a topic that's important for math, but this can also come up on social studies and science, so it's important to know how to do these calculations. So pause the video, try to figure this out, and then we'll go over it. Okay, so first let's get the mean. So the mean is just another word for average. And so to take the average, what you want to do is you want to take the add up all of the numbers that are in our data set and then you're going to count up the total number of numbers in the data set and you're going to do a division. All right, so let me show you how to do that because sometimes when you listen to a mathematical explanation, it doesn't always make a whole lot of sense. So let me show you how to do it here. So basically what I'm doing here, so I'm just taking all the numbers in the data set. So I took this three right here, I took the seven, I took the four, took the two and the three, and you can see that I'm gonna add them all up here. All right, I'm just gonna put brackets around this. So I wanna add these up, and then I wanna divide by the total number of numbers in the data set. So let's count them up. We have one, two, three, four, five. All right, so there's five numbers in my data set. So we're gonna divide it by five. So if I add all those numbers up, I get 19. All right, so then I'm gonna do 19 divided by five. So I get 3.8. So the mean is 3.8. All right, so to find the median, what a lot of people remember when they hear the word median is that it has something to do with the middle number. And that is correct. It does have to do with the middle number, but it's not completely correct. All right, that's part of it. But you first have to put the numbers in order from smallest to largest. So just remember that if you ever get the median, put the numbers in order from smallest to largest and then find the middle number. So here the middle number is three, all right? And so whenever you've got an odd number of numbers in your data set, which we do because we have five, you just put them in order from smallest to largest. And the one right in the middle here is gonna be the median. Now, if we had had an even number of numbers, you'd have to look at the two numbers in the middle add those up and divide by two. So we're not gonna do that here for this problem, um, but just remember that that's something that you would have to do if you had an even number of numbers. So now what we have to do to find the mode, I want you to know that the mode is just the most occurring number in your data set. All right, so you wanna look at the data set again, which we have the numbers here. We see that we have two threes. So therefore three occurs most, three is our mode. Now the range is probably the simplest one to calculate for the range, all you're gonna do is you take the biggest number in the data set, and the biggest number here is seven, and you're gonna take the smallest number, which is two, and you just subtract them. So seven minus two gives us five, all right? And so the correct answer here is C. Now, if you wanna look at the written answer, you can pause the video. You can take your time and read the written solution if you'd like to.